Hello. Today we're going to be building a dolly wheel idler system. Um, these can be used on a variety of PVC pipe. Um, we also offer a drive uh, dolly uh, wheeled system. But today we're just going to demonstrate putting the idler package together here. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to actually assemble the idler shafts utilizing, utilizing our little center hole washer systems here. Put the screws in here. We're going to tighten this up as tight as we can here. Got two of these we're going to be putting together. Start on the second one here. Slide it through. Washer. And idle shaft again. So we're going to go ahead and tighten that down. Now that we have those two complete, next we're going to go ahead and grab our plates here. Both of them are identical black uh, acetyl or Delrin plates. We're going to go ahead and use our quarter inch 622 or 632, I should say, screws. Now, one thing you'll notice here is there's a number of holes along the side. Um, these are fully adjustable. I guess you'd say the um, um, shaft systems here can adjust up and down. This is really going to determine what diameter of tubing you want to run on. So but we're going to go ahead and mount on the lowest location, which means our tubing that we're going to run on is about a one inch diameter. So, but that can easily be changed later. I'm going to go ahead and tighten those on. We're just going to kind of barely cinch everything down first. Put both of them on here. I'm not going to tighten it too tight right off the bat. Go ahead and put on the second plate on the opposing side. So just drop the screws in and give it a twist or two. And now we can go ahead and tighten them up pretty tight here. Like I said before, this is the idle system so this one won't be powered at all we offered a we offer a powered system and we'll show that in a another video so now we've got both of our idle shafts mounted into our plate next we're going to go put on our top plate and this is just to keep these two plates perfectly parallel with one another and also it offers a really good mounting, an additional mounting um, pattern on the top which kind of comes in helpful with various designs or changes you might want to make. Very good. So now we're ready to mount our wheels. Now obviously you've got a variety of wheels you can mount on but we, we sell our, um, basically it's called a skate wheel but we mount some eight millimeter by 22 millimeter ball bearings which is basically a standard standard ball bearing for skate you can go to our site and pick these up they're pretty inexpensive but just don't forget to buy purchase the ball bearings for this application so we're going to go ahead and put those on actually we're going to reach through here first and make sure these are really tight there we go I'm go ahead and slide these on you want to use a little number six washer on the top that way the wheels don't Come sliding off. Put that one on here. Cinch that down. Over here. The second one on. There we go. And as you can see here, the cool thing about this part or this this package here is that it's got our 150 pattern with our one inch center hole and it allows a huge variety of um, or multiple variety of mounting locations you can use it with obviously one inch tubing or you can use it with our channel as well so there you go it's ready to be mounted and if you go to our site you can see where these things are used in multiple applications but obviously in dolly and videography applications so there you go